formerly known as Constantinople and Byzantium, Istanbul is unlike any other city in the world, straddling Europe and Asia. And tonight, we're on the Asian side of the city, as Fenerbahce Istanbul play host to reigning champion Cesca Moscow. The home side find themselves in fourth place in the standings with 13 wins and 7 losses. And an ever-present fixture for Fenerbahce so far this season is Bobby Dixon, who was simply sensational when these teams went to 14. 25 points and 6 assists helped Fenerbahce to a thrilling overtime road win against the champions. That was Cesca's second loss of the season and started a three-game losing streak, leaving the players, Coach Atudis and the fans frustrated. Luigi Ditome had a quiet 30 minutes in that game, but has been electrifying ever since. The sharpshooter connecting from all over the court to average 15 points per game in his last six outings, with an average performance index rating of 16. And of course, the Italian is ice cool at the free throw line, He's yet to miss this season. Today's visitors started the season on fire, but in round seven, Dara Shaka Kadoshi Istanbul inflicted their first defeat. Cesca responded with another six-game win streak before Fenerbahce overwhelmed them in OT. And since then, they've only won three of their last six. And the Turkish side threw the dub over Cesca tonight. They come into the game after a hard-fought win over Galatasaray, where Jan Vesely was inspirational, 20.7 rebounds and a performance index rating of 30. Crown player of the game. Seska edged past FS thanks to strong outings from Nando De Colo and Kyle Hines, who posted a double double of 13 points and 10 boards. The Russian side the winners by just a few points. The head to head makes for favorable reading if you're a Seska fan, but Benavache have won four of the last seven meetings. We're in Istanbul for a repeat of last year's final as Fenerbahce Istanbul take on Seska Moscow in round 21's Game of the Week in the Turkish Airlines Euroleague.